In today's video, I'm offering 10 reasons why you need a life coach. Now, I had a few questions in, all very similar in context, that were essentially asking, you know, what do life coaches do and uh, what are the benefits of them? So I thought in today's video, I'm gonna give you those 10 important reasons and hopefully it might sway you into the idea of finding a life coach yourself. So without further ado, we'll get started. So these are in no particular order, but reason number one is that life coaches are good listeners. So besides them being trained to actively listen to what their uh, their clients are struggling with, um, they, they take that opportunity to really hear a person out and uh, pick the important pieces of information that they can relay back to a client that gives them maybe that third person perspective or further insight into an idea that they have or something that they want to develop or pursue. So reason number two is that we don't tolerate people's crap. If you're coming to us as a client, we're not here to listen to you just share all your life problems and this and that. We want you to get results. So if you just end up sitting there spewing all this sort of victim mentality, then we'll say, stop, stop moaning about stuff. And what can we do to get on with things and change your lifestyle and situation so you are gonna get results? Reason number three is that we will hold you accountable for your actions. So don't think that if you're sitting around all day long and hoping that your situation is going to change, we'll tell you how it is and the things that you need to actively be doing to get those changes in your life. And that then means being able to hold you accountable, giving you homework to do, and then checking in with you to make sure that you are completing every task that has been requested. Because if you don't, don't, then the easy answer is, is that you're not going to get the results that you want. But if you do, then of course, you're going to move in a direction that is going to be way more beneficial for you than you probably have ever even imagined. So reason number four is that we'll give you that third person perspective or that different point of view on a problem. I think, and this is most people in general, is that we're all very one dimensional when it comes to any idea that we have. We sort of have this idea in mind or this goal in mind, we're going to go out and do it, but we don't think about well, what kind of problems may come up, what kind of implications, are there any other strategies or ways to complete this same problem or thing that you want to achieve? And by having a life coach, being able to, again, actively listen to what the issues are that you have or listen to the goals that you want to strive for, they can give you different opinions and also get just challenge you on those ideas that you've got so you can actually think about doing things maybe in a way that's gonna get you your results faster or potentially easier. So reason number five is that a life coach will challenge you on your thoughts and beliefs. Now we all have limiting beliefs and uh, negative thoughts of sorts that we've developed over the years and that can hold us back on the things that we want to do. But does that mean that those uh, thoughts or memories are necessarily correct? Absolutely not. Unfortunately, we can get brought up to be trained in believing things that aren't quite correct and we do need someone to kind of point that out. And that's one of the things that a life coach can do. They can point out those errors in your thoughts and belief systems, challenge them on you. And then again, it get you to shift that perspective into going like, oh, actually, you know what? Instead of not being confident, you know what? I am confident. I do believe in myself. So just having that level of support and even just that conviction of a new truth being relayed to you that can make all the difference with getting results. Which leads on to reason number six, which is that a life coach will help you to reach your full potential. So when you've got someone who kind of acts as like your uh, your Jiminy Cricket, that little that little sort of like cockroach or or grasshopper thing that that sits on your shoulder from from Pinocchio, uh, who tells you, you know what's right from wrong and just gives you that motivation that you need to uh, to do well or do better, then that can help you. Just have that extra nudge in getting that success. 
Which does lead on to point number seven, is that they offer you the support when you need it the most. So, so many people do try and tend to turn to friends and family for support, but unfortunately, if these friends and family don't have this same ideologies or thought processes as you, or see things in the same kind of way you do, then it can be very difficult to get that support that you need from people. But at least with a life coach, they are open to hearing your ideas and working out or uh, brainstorming with you the best way that you can achieve them. So number eight is that life coaches are trained to give you the right kind of advice that you need. So again, unlike with what friends and family might do, they might just sort of like shrug off your ideas or say, oh, that's a terrible idea. With a life coach, they will, through their own training and skills and understanding and experience, they will be able to, again, give you that right kind of support that you need by hearing, again, what you are planning to do, what you want to work towards, and then help you to structure a system and maybe even like a step-by-step -step system or guide that can help you to get to where you want to go. And number nine, in fact, this is probably one of the most important things is that most coaches are able to sympathize with your struggles. So like with me, I've worked in the dating industry for 15 years. I understand the journeys and the struggles and the, uh, the anxiety problems that so many men have when they want to improve their date in life or just be more confident in general. I've seen the transformations. I've helped create the transformations and journeys and stories that people all around the world have watched of dating coaches working with their clients getting the results. And sometimes the best life coaches or coaches to go to are the ones that have been on very similar stories or journeys that you want to go on yourself. And they understand exactly every step again that you need to take. They will be able to give you the advice and feedback that you need to hear to get you the results, especially if they've gone through the whole trial and error process themselves. So it can be even more important to go to a life coach, especially ones that specialize in particular fields that you want to improve yourselves in, because, you know, a life coach, yes, can help you with everything in general, but there are also coaches that can help you with very spe uh, specific or particular topics, uh, as well as being able to give the life coaching and advice and feedback within those topics. And lastly, for point number 10, having a life coach helps you to improve your return of investment or ROI, especially in regards to time. So it's so easy, especially if pride and maybe ego gets the better of you, or maybe you just want to try and do something yourself without the need of going to anyone for help, which is fantastic if you can do that. But a lot of people just delay the inevitable where they will struggle for so long uh, refusing the idea to actually seek help and then when they finally get the help they just speed through getting to the results that they want and sometimes just going to a coach or a professional sooner than later isn't really accepting defeat it is just accepting that, you know what, you want to get your results even faster. You don't want to waste your time. You want to get the experience that you need in the right kind of positive way, and you want the support for it as well. And so by going to a life coach, you're only going to get your results faster and most likely better because you're also getting that experience and correct positive advice from someone. So those are my 10 reasons why you definitely need a life coach. Now, uh, as much as I'm going to say I would love to be able to plug my life coaching services here, and maybe I kind of will, but even if you don't choose me as a life coach, just going to a life coach is so beneficial for you. It can make all of the difference with getting results. I've seen guys, especially in the dating field, who have put off even going to like a dating coach for years 
And then they've complained all of that time as well, how their dating life is awful, or if they've been going out trying to do cold approaching via doing like street approaching or in bars and clubs and stuff, and they've just been getting horrific results and it hasn't worked out for them because they just haven't been able to have a third person perspective on the things that they're struggling with. You're only just delaying the uh, the overcoming of the problems for yourself. So, you know, I would love it if you would come to me, but if not, there are certainly so many other life coaches out there that do just such phenomenal work. I'm, I, I mean, I've known life coaches as well over the years, and I've even gone to a life coach in the past, and the difference that it really does make, just getting that feedback, just hearing someone else tell you like that you are good enough you can get the results that you want but you just need to work towards it it's a bit like having your own personal trainer but just much for not really in the gym but just certainly for for more life changing experiences so i would love to know your thoughts if maybe you've worked with a life coach what has your results been like with them or what kind of hesitations maybe you've got about working with a life coach that would be just as interesting and very curious to know as well but if you can please like the video subscribe to the channel so you can stay up to date on certainly more videos that will help you to overcome your anxiety in dating and uh, i also look forward to hearing your your comments below and maybe even future video ideas too